I'm sorry, Bravo. I'm sorry. Please, please don't hurt me. Please, please, please. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to hurt her legs. Please, she just, I can't help myself. She's just so young. Young, fresh. I can't, I can't help. Oh. He who trusts in his own heart is a fool. But oh. he who walks wisely will deliver. Everything here, our mm. dancers, my girls, the boys on the streets, are my problem. Mm. They cannot be hurt beyond a condition mm. because of your stupidity. Mm. Russia might run this shit whole town, he thinks. But I'm the final word. An example must be made, and you will be the example. Jesus Christ! No! 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 Well, isn't that cute? Even in death, he's trying to object death. You know, you gotta love my face. I'm sure I have the last word. Call it dumpster guy. Why in a minute? Red light's supposed to be blinking? I don't know. These things are so high tech these days. Poke it. Uh, no. You might break it. Oh, you're right. Hey, mommy, daddy. You guys are looking good. I think the treatments are doing well. What did the doctor say? Oh, honey. Don't you worry, your pretty little head. Things are progressing very well. <clears throat> Thanks to your payments, we're finally able to pay off some of our mortgage and chemo bills. <clears throat> but we want to know about you. How are you? And where is Kai? Uh, he's, he's fine. <laughs> he's going to high school nearby, as you know. Uh, soon he'll be able to help out with the bills. Where is he? We went a long time <clears throat> to talk to him. Shouldn't he <coughs> be home? It's fine, you guys. You know how young people are today. He studies hard, but he plays hard too. He's got a new girlfriend, I think. <coughs> Anyways, uh, I got it going. I have to get up early tomorrow for my job. Okay, okay, Leah. But first, tell me, how are your kids? My what? Kids at school. You are a teacher, aren't you? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, yeah. The kids, they're really good. Um, doing well, so, anyways. I have to go. I love you guys bunches. Um, I'll send you money after my paycheck next week. Yeah, don't worry about anything, okay? Just get better. We'll talk again soon.
have you been? I thought we had a deal to keep in touch. If you had to stay out late or couldn't come home, you're only 15 for crying out loud. God, Mom and Dad called last night, and I had no idea what to tell them. Why do you worry them so much? Have you forgotten that they're dying of cancer? No! You get off of me, sis! We do what we have to to survive. I'll try to help out with money, but right now I've got my studies. What studies? I haven't seen you crack a book in weeks. Get off of me, sis. I just have to move out. No! <laughs> The toilet is clogged! Hey, Dad, let me call you back on the landline, okay? What? Emergency. Mom? Wait, what? Dad? How much? I don't think... The house? Wait. No, no, no. I'll find a way to get you some money, okay? Don't, don't sell the house, Dad, okay? Put your hands together for our lovely and beautiful Jill Von Kahn! Yeah! Who's she anyway? Mad Wolf's new toy? 
What are you, a fag or something? Who are you calling a fag? Do you have any idea who you're talking to? Slit your throat right where you stand. No, 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 Russia. That was a mistake. We, we apologize. Let's just have another drink. Doing? Kai, get away whoa, from whoa, me! Whoa, whoa, shit, 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 shit. whoa, 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 what the hell did I tell you about coming around here? Oh, yo, whoa, what's up? Oh. Get the hell out of here and leave this lovely girl alone. Now! Hey, man. Permit me to introduce myself. I go by the name Mad Wolf. An affection for my childhood. I must warn you, Matt. It's not safe walking these streets at night, particularly here. Oh, thank you, Mago. I don't know what I would have done without your help. Who was that guy? Why did he attack me? I don't understand. Do you know him? Let me take you to dinner, please. Walk me home. Of course. We have plenty of time. Hey, Daddy. Uh, I've got some more money for you and Mommy. How... how is Mommy? She's okay. She's been... <coughs> she's been stabilized and moved to an intensive treatment room. Honey? We don't have much longer to live for. I love you, Daddy. I love you too, my sunshine. Bye for now. Bye, Dad.
Hi, you need to log on to Melvin's account. He's sick today. Mad Wolf said to put on your French maid outfit for the customers. Tonight is naughty helpless night. The customers eat that shit up. Straight or not, go get him, tiger. Any way I can help you. I know you're going through something and I just want to help. Please tell me what's wrong. Tell me why school is no longer important and where you go each night. Please, I worry about you so much. I love you and I feel so alone in dealing with mom and dad. Can we get through this and be there for mom and dad too? Sis, would you kindly pass me the cereal? I need to eat something before I go to school. Uh, I have to go to work. Love you. Let me pass. I have a right to be inside just like everyone else. Whoa, whoa, easy, bitch. I decide who goes in and out of this place. You should get out of here before I kick your ass. I have no idea who you are, you fucking lunatic, but I will get inside and see my brother. So. <laughs> no, you off. Get off. I don't pay you to beat up the customers. I don't think this skinny little thing could cause much trouble. Please. Come on! She just walks in here. I'm a bouncer. Let me hear her out. Come on. It's alright. Look, Mr. Russian, sir, there's there's been some kind of mistake. I, I, my brother just went in there. Please, I just need to talk to him. She's lying! Filthy men. It was. But please, let me explain. Did you know that approximately 800,000 children under the age of 18 go missing every year? Some are taken by a parent or someone that they know. Others are kidnapped, raped, or even murdered. 
Some leave terrible home lives and come to a place like this. A place where men from all over pay to see these children in certain acts, we'll say. Well, I'm sure they appreciate your concern, seeing as they're doing the exact same thing in your fine establishment. I saw those girls out there running like pigs under those filthy, disgusting men. They should have their dicks cut off. There are those who want to put an end to places like this. But it takes time and manpower and enough proof to make sure that something like this never happens again. It's hard. There are men out there with money and power and needs that need to be met. Needs that would have the wife running in terror. Like I said, since you have this place, I don't see the need for your hypocrisy. Look, I am doing something about it right now. Something that I found out could help so much. Or found out could get me killed. My name is Officer Yakov. I'm working undercover with many others to try and bring down this international prostitution ring. I promise you, I will bring down this ring, and I will help your brother too. That you mustn't tell anybody about this. Keep your ear to the ground, because any intel could put a nail into their coffin. Fucking bitch. Nobody screws with Mad Wolf. Just like that, she thinks she's gonna team up with that wimp Russian? A.K.A. Officer Jakob to take me down. I knew he smelled like a rat. I couldn't find anything about him anywhere. I thought he was just secret out of necessity. All our enemies have opened their mouths against us. Don't worry, baby. You know that I'm here for you. Just tell me what you want to have done. And I'll do it. I'm gonna have fun with her again. Smack her around a bit, but not kill her. That my beauty? I'll leave to you. I can't do this shit anymore, man. Not anymore. Gentlemen, put your hands together for our one and only Miss Von Puff. Is so awesome. Where did you get this? I hope you don't mind I took it. You seem to be okay with taking things. Things that aren't yours. My man? Hmm? What, what are you talking about? Mad Wolf. I, I didn't take him from you. No, he came onto me. Yeah, what did you do? Did you do this? What? No. Huh? Is that it? I can smell him on you. You're gonna die over there. What are you, what are you gonna do to me? Kill you. No, no, please, Vessel, please. I, 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 don't, I don't love Mad Wolf. I was just lonely. Please, my parents, they have got cancer. They're gonna die if I don't get, get money to them for their treatments. And, and my brother, please, please, Vessel, no. Please don't kill me, please, no. Life's a bitch. <laughs> Yeah, 
What are you doing here? Look, I don't have time. I got a lot of things to do. The racket virus doesn't run itself. I'm very well aware of that. Guess that's why I couldn't figure out why. A little no one like yourself. I came in and took over here. I took over something. I built up just fine by myself. Especially since that no one was someone I'd never heard of. You know very well that I was number two and that I was told to come here. Nobody goes anywhere without the right say so. That's true. A little bird told me something else. This little bird told me that you're an undercover cop. And I treat undercover cops the same way I do worthless prostitutes, lying thieves, and those who try to take over my territory. I kill them. <clears throat> Dance again. Up. I guess. From what? From what? Uh, 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 you remind me of someone. Someone I used to love. Someone I used to care about. Someone who's gone now. We have to go. What? We have to go. We have to save your brother before it's too late. We have to go right now. Okay? Right now. <laughs> you think you were dead? Yeah. You wish you were when I'm done with you. But sadly, I'm gonna need some answers. Or somebody will die. Leave her alone. I'll tell you whatever you want to know. <laughs> Got time for this lovey duffy bullshit right now. Officer Jacob is in major trouble, and your brother is selling his flesh. How do you know about Officer Jacob? I overheard one of Wolf's conversations. God. That's why Bessel and you and Mad Wolf? Listen, listen. Yeah. Look, alright. Mad Wolf's a crazy psycho son of a bitch, alright? And he's crippled too many souls in the name of God. It's time to put an end to it, alright? Right now. Officer Jakob is in major fucking trouble, and your brother is in his booth, okay? Get to him. But right now, we gotta go, alright? Fast. Okay. And we'll meet a bit later, okay? Sorry. <laughs> 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 
And that is only the beginning, Officer Jakob! Yo, Wolf! I'm here to take what you owe me, motherfucker! And what would that be? Your life! He that overcometh shall inherit all things. That will be his God. That too. I gave you money, power, bitches. I gave you everything. Now this is how you pay me back. Remember Isabel? That dirty cunt that gave me blue balls. That dirty cunt was the only person I could ever love in my miserable shut of a life. You raped her! You, you slit her throat! <laughs> but the Lord is with me. It's a mighty terrible one. Therefore my persecutors shall stumble. And they shall not prevail. They will be greatly ashamed. For they will not prosper. And their everlasting confusion shall never be forgotten. Oh my god! It's really over! It's really over! <gasps>